Whoa! <laughs> what is that guy? I had quite a terrible experience earlier, so I can't remain calm. <laughs> what the heck? They seem pretty confused. What the heck is this guy? Hi everyone, welcome to Your Turn to Die, Death Game by Majority. Um, this is the new game that I'm going to be playing on my channel. Um, it is... V okay, so I don't know much about it. I've never played this game before. I know that it's very similar to Danganronpa. I know that there are deaths that happen. It's in the title. Um, it's pretty obvious. Um, I know that it has like an 8-bit feeling to it, even when the text dialogue is playing. It's a visual novel, I know that much too. And this is, I'm playing this in a browser because that's the only way you can play the full game, I believe. And yeah, that's pretty much it for introductions. I think I just want to jump into this, honestly. Um, I don't know the controls yet, but actually... I can probably find it in the options, right? Um... I don't know. Okay, well, let's just go into it. Uh... Okay. Okay, escape is to go back. Do I use the arrow keys? Oh. Yes, I do. Okay, you don't use the W... S... W A S D keys, apparently. Okay. Oh, there's chapters. What's that? Final chapter... Oh, what? Huh. Um, no, we're not gonna do that. Okay, actually, I wanna look up something real quick. I wanna see if this game has been finished, because I actually didn't look that up yet. Um, let's do that real quick. Your turn to die. Is the game finished? Um, yeah, actually, I think it is finished, because I started a second game. It's called Your Turn to Shine. We're gonna play that too, but first we're just gonna start with this game. So let's go. Let's press begin. I mean, this is a little itchy. Sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. Yeah, so that's the 8 bit dialogue sounds I was talking about. Okay. Oh, I also know that the main character is a female, which is like, oh, she's on the front thing, so. Okay, ellipses. I don't know who's talking, so I'm just gonna do like, hey. Oh. Actually, that could be <laughs> the voice. Hiya. Just a random question. But you know what a majority vote is. But you know what a majority vote is? I think that's what I was trying to say. It. Um, yeah, I'm just going to press no idea, just to get an explanation. It's just like the, per the person who's voted for the most. How unusual. Well, this is an interesting looking guy. Oh, he looks creepy. It's when people are deciding something, and the choice that gets picked by the most people is what gets used. Yeah, that. Oh. Oh! Looks like somebody's over there. <laughs> look at those icons. <laughs> they look like bathroom icons. Mr. Blue. I love majority votes. They represent the way democracy should be. Following the will of the people. It's a method that minimizes conflict. Miss Red. I hate majority votes. They're just a way to silence the majority. It only makes more darkness build in the... Oh, no. They're just a way to silence the minority. It only makes more darkness build in the shadows. Interesting. So... Ugh. <laughs> that was a really bad sigh. Hold on. Ugh. Sounds like they're having some tedious argument. Incidentally, whose opinion do you support? Mr. Blue's or Miss Red's? Um. Honestly, I want to support Miss Red's. I feel like I support Miss Red's more because, like, on, I, it always bo bothers me when we have to go with, like, the majority and not listen to every opinion. That's something that always bothers me. I'm going to go with Mrs. Red's. Yeah. Whoa. He just died. Like, why do you look like he's in like a a like a pool of blood? Like he sunk into it. That is, <laughs> Jesus. Oh, uh, he died. Why? Why is he so like nonchalant about it? Well, good for you. Your opinion had more supporters. Oh, that's good. My nose is really itchy right now. Oh my god. 
With that experience, your sides learn the terror of a majority vote. Okay. Is that how this game is gonna work? Huh? What was that sound? <laughs> it was like, <laughs> If that makes you happy, then don't you have to recognize the appeal of majority votes? I guess. Sure is complicated. Hmm? What's with that look? If you'd known the other person would die, you wouldn't have voted? I guess. Yeah. Sheesh. That won't get you anywhere, okay? That's what the game is all about. Okay. Don't look pleased, huh? Who is this guy? <laughs> look creepy. Alright, if you insist, let's hold a vote. Your opinion versus mine. Okay then, let's go. Oh! That was really creepy. Oh, that was really scary. Whoa, what the hell? Look at those hands. Look really old. Wait, what are we doing? Oh? I'm just clicking the mouse. Okay. Every time it just does that. Oh! Whoa, 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 what is going on? What the f- <laughs> This is so creepy. Who is this? Ugh. I'm gonna try and give it a general neutral voice. I had a weird dream. My jaws. Whoa! <laughs> that scared the heck out of me! My alarm just went off! What? I forgot I had that because I took a nap earlier, I'm sorry. <laughs> That scared me. Oh. Okay, yeah, it's gone. Um, my jaw is sore. Honestly, my jaw is sore too. Like, I had, like, this tension headache all day. Like, no. Oh, God. It was on this side. Right now it's, like, on this side. That sucks. Um, my jaw is sore. Because I was sleeping with my head on my desk. Oh, I hate that feeling. I, I hate that. Like, oh, and then, like, the drool, like, dries on your mouth. Ugh. I f I've fallen asleep before in class <laughs> back in high school. Oh, I have to click in the text box to make an advance. This late already? I have to go home. Better hurry. I feel like oh yeah okay oh Sarah interesting. Oh, what's all this down here? Okay, I gotta think of a voice for her. Whoa. It's gone completely dark. That works. Touch spots that look interesting to investigate. Okay, oh, everything's pixelated. Ooh, I like the noise. What's this data down here? Oh, okay. Um. Okay, well, this is a lot of information. Son of Beno High School. ID number. That's not a number. Samurai Ona. Grade, second year. Name Sarah. I don't know how to pronounce that. Chidoin, maybe. Height, weight. Okay, so her. Oh, we don't have a weight for her. She's five five. This person is confirmed as a student of the school. Son of Beno High School principal. Wait, are we the principal? Oh no no no! The principal said that. I think yeah. Um, we have items. No, we don't. <laughs> we don't have items. Okay, press escape to go back. Options. Auto dash. Um, can I like see where the controls are? I can save my game. Okay, let's do that. Sure. All right, and then let's go back. So we, we, you're supposed to investigate things. I see a window lit up. Let's look at the pond. The campus pond. There's a rumor that if you look into it at midnight, the reflection will talk to you. Could be a great thing to a loner. I guess. Um, what's that over there? Oh, oh, it's just like a little spark. Okay, that doesn't work. Wait, I can't. So, okay. This then? Yeah. The lights are on. Maybe it's the guard. Thanks for your tireless service. <laughs> uh, somebody's. <laughs> I'm already seeing her being like a little awkward. <laughs> oh my god. Sometimes writers will, like, write things very interestingly, like, they'll put in, like, little quips, like, Thank you for your tireless service, or, like, 
Just like little quirky things. I don't know. It's just a little strange, but that's all right. Seeing the school like this, it feels totally different at night. Oh. The lights. I have to walk home when it's this dark? Why do I feel like she's gonna get kidnapped? That's how these games always go. The front gate of the school. Can't go home without going through it. <laughs> that was pretty obvious. I don't want to leave yet. What? Am I supposed to? <gasps> ah! Oh my god! Someone's there! I knew it! I knew she was getting kidnapped. Wait, what? Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she was like... Whoa! Okay, okay, she wasn't. She wasn't. <laughs> this is fucking scary. Joe, okay. What you doing, Sarah? No, I gotta do a different voice than the other guy. What you doing, Sarah? Okay, whatever. Fine, that works. <laughs> Joe! Joe Tazuna, or rather, Joe. My classmate at school. We often found ourselves together. Oh, you like friends? Oh, you stuck around this late for clubs? I was gonna wither up from waiting. Oh, I like his style. It's interesting. Kind of reminds me of um, another character from a different game. I'm not gonna say, though. Whoa. Whoa, okay. <laughs> this is music. Well, it's fine. Listen, there's something I want to tell you. Something to tell me? Whoa. My thanks! Thanks? For what, I wonder? That's a weird way to phrase that. Oh, you know, you introduced us, right? Me and Ryoko. Oh, like from Danganronpa? <laughs> right. She's such a good girl. I'm moved. What? Oh, that's creepy way to say that. I guess like a little dog in his pocket. I never noticed that. <laughs> that's funny. Oh, he has a little bone on... Oh, maybe he's like into dogs. Cute, huh? Adorable. And I saw her swallow a donor kebab hole today. Hole today. She's a real glutton to boot. Ugh. A whole donor kebab? Wait, you went on a date? I don't like that smack sound. <laughs> Was on it till just a second ago. Came back to school so I could brag about it to you. You should have just gone home. Alright, bragging complete. <laughs> okay. Let's go home, Sarah. Oh, they like... What? Okay, well, you're not coming home with me. Oh, we can move now. Okay. Path home. Let's do it. Alright. So we have data and move. Oh, shoot. Look at this place. Oh, there's like a little poster over there. And then, Ryoko and I finally... How long even is this story? You listening? We made huge progress. This guy's such a pain. I don't care. Or did you kiss her? I want to know. I want to know. Shit. Don't be stupid. Doing that on the first date? They call people like that monsters. Why do I feel like every time that sounds happening, he's like slapping us? <laughs> every time I hear that sound, I feel like someone's getting slapped. <laughs> oh my god. Monsters. We held hands. Outrageous progress, right? I guess. I mean, it was mostly that I fell in a ditch. She was helping me out, but... Why are there ditches in this place? But how gaudy you look. You're awfully shy. Huh? Gaudy this ain't. What? Gaudy this ain't. I don't know how to read that. <laughs> I'm hurt, man. That seriously gets to me. Damn it. Maybe I should go back to a crew cut like in middle school. Ew. What are these noises? They're so loud, too. Now he started moping. Um. A poster warning to watch out for strangers. Okay. I think the green text I could just read like my, my usual self. What's this on the ground? Uh. Okay. A faint street light illuminates the area. Interesting. I've rarely ever walked home at this hour. It feels really dark. What's up? Wanna hold hands? Dude, what? Why? Eh? 
Oh, maybe just for like protection. I guess that's fine. Whoa. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Why are these la noises so loud? Oh, crap! I pressed escape. I didn't mean to advance the dialogue. He said something about probably crushing his hands. That's pretty rude. It's not like I'm boasting about it. But real talk. Wouldn't it help things if you got a boyfriend? Um, I guess. <laughs> Ellipses. What? Why is this getting so serious? You can't sleep right because you're a stalker. Oh no. Is that why you always go home with me? She has a stalker? The dummy? I just wanted to brag. Thank you. For what, man? Well, if you just feel like being grateful, I won't stop you. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. All right, let's mosey on. Let's mosey along now. Parents will be worried if you're late. Right. So she has a stalker. Interest. Oh. Okay. Right before we deal with that, I'm just gonna turn down. Wait, I don't know which one it would be. No. Okay, this is music. I don't know what this is. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna leave it. It's really loud and scary, but we're just gonna go with it because that's okay. <laughs> Who is that? Oh my god! I have to run! Joe, run! Huh? Oh my god! Oh my god, <laughs> that's so scary. Oh my god, at least we made it home. <laughs> oh, phew. We made it home. We don't have the same home, do we? Jesus Christ, that's scary. <laughs> it's okay. Should be fine now that we're here. Is that the stalker? Joe. Um. Eh, I'm relieved now. <laughs> I'm relieved. If I'd gone home by myself. <laughs> Why did it do it like that? That guy was staring. And it seemed like, yeah, his eyes got really big. He was trying to talk to me? No, thank you. Well, your parents are waiting, Sarah. Yeah. Hey, Joe. Be careful. Yeah. Please be careful. See you tomorrow at school. Yeah, what if the guy comes for him? Okay, guess I'll go in. Hmm? The uh, what? 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 Yeah. What? Should they be on? The house lights aren't on. Is that bad? The house nameplate. I I feel like I should just go inside right away. But I mean, this light's on. <laughs> a fancy lamp lights up the front porch. Oh, so it's not a power outage. Oh. I can see the living room through the window, but the lights aren't on. Oh, so she, at least you can see inside. My good old front door. The door's unlocked. Oh, God, what? Oh, just to go in? Okay, we have to go inside the house this way. Oh, my God, why is my phone buzzing? Stop it! Okay, you know what? I'm gonna... <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to yell. I'm gonna put on Do Not Disturb. Oh, my God, this is kind of spooky. I didn't know this game was so spooky. Oh. Oh. Um. It's dark. Why aren't the lights on? The plants knocked over. <laughs> Mom, Dad, are you home? <laughs> Sorry, the sniffles. <laughs> What's going on? The plants fallen over. Something's weird about the house. Over here is the bathroom. <laughs> the living room. Normally, Mom would be in here watching TV and waiting for me. Uh. Back there is the door to my parents' room. I only feel like something happened to her parents. The stairs to the second floor. My room is up there. <laughs> go. We go in the living room first before we go to the second floor. Let's go in the living room since she was talking about that. <laughs> okay. It's pitch black. This is bizarre. There can't be no one 
It can't be no one here. That's where everybody say that. I'll turn on the lights. Uh. Oh, too dark to see. Oh, okay. Let's do it. Light switch. Turn on lights. I have a bad feeling. Mmm. We haven't gone upstairs yet. I'm just gonna do it. Okay, turning them on. Oh no! Oh my god! M Mom? Mom! 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 What's that? Oh my god. Wait, okay, hold on. Let's look at this first. Oh, it's a key. Okay. There's a key on the floor. Obtain room key. Why is this here? Oh my god. Okay, well, let's look at the obvious. Mom, hang in there! She's breathing. It looks like she fainted. It looks like she- Oh, I thought that was a pool of blood under her. That's a shadow. <laughs> okay. That's better. What do I do? What do I do? Um, I don't have tissues over here. Ugh. Well, I guess I don't need tissues, but like, I need to like brush my- not brush my teeth, blow my nose. I'm like, ugh. So much. Um, okay, are we supposed to go upstairs then? Door leads to my parents' room. Okay. Back to the hallway. Wait, actually? Oh, God, Jesus fucking Christ. Sarah! Joe! Please help, my mom collapsed! Stay calm, did you call the hospital, the cops? Why do I feel like he's involved in this? Not yet, I need- I need to call. I'll handle it. Listen, Sarah, you need to be calm. Why do you- why do you know what's going on? <laughs> oh, maybe he heard her scream and came in. Joe started to make a call. What am I doing? I'm all out of sorts. But I need to do something. Something. Should I go upstairs? Let's go upstairs. The key to Sarah's room? Okay. It's locked. Room key. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. I'll open it. Use the room key. The door opened. Ah. Ah, okay. Dad? Dad, are you here? Why didn't you check your parents' room? Wouldn't that be where he would be? Ma why would he be in your room? Mom collapsed! Dad, where are... No. No! What the hell? What the hell? Your turn to die. Death game by majority. I think the game's starting. Presented by Nankidai. Nan Nankidai. Maybe. I don't know how to pronounce that. Oh my god. Oh. Ugh. Oh no. Oh, we don't know where we are. Oh, we got knocked out, probably. Where is this, I wonder? Where? Where is this, I wonder? Okay, yeah, it's more like narration. Am I looking at the ceiling? Why am I sleeping here? Remember the situation, remember myself. What? Remember myself? Wait, huh? Wait, does she not know who she is? I think I went home. Right, and then mom! Mom! I quickly tried to sit up, but I couldn't. Is there something on my head? What? Then calmly touch it to ch I'm gonna touch it to check! <laughs> I fearfully touched my head. With some kind of belt or machine. What? <laughs> Am I tied to it? Uh, it's like I'm being restrained. Oh my god. No way! <laughs> What's the meaning of this? My temperature rose. Suddenly, fear awakened me. No, where is this? Somebody! I have no freedom to move. Besides my head, my left arm, torso, and legs also seem to be restrained. Jesus. 
All I could move was my right arm. Someone! I was about to scream, then went quiet. The stalker. He harmed my mom. And he brought me here. Oh my god, how did he get to your house before you? I wonder, am I going to be killed? Hopefully not. Sarah, are you there? That voice. Joe, is that you? Are you next to me? Yeah, but I can't move. Can't you do something? Joe's in the same situation? Oh, God. A phone? Search pocket or ask Joe? Um. Search pocket. I searched my pocket with my free hand, but found nothing. Okay, ask Joe. Joe, is that your orders ringing? Eh? You're right, something's in my pocket. Something in my pockets. I think that's how I was supposed to be read. Here. Hello? Whoever you are, help us! Whoa. Beginning voiced guidance. Okay. Huh? The first trial will uh, the first trial will now begin. Sarah and Joe find the key hidden in this room. Or I feel like it would be something like that. Then remove your restraints. If you do not do so before the time limit expires, the device on the beds will activate. They're on all oh, they're on beds. And your bodies will be crushed with a thud. Oh my god. By all means, please enjoy this thrill with all your body and soul. The time limit is a healthy five minutes. Jesus. Wait. Do I have like an actual time limit? And note that there is only one key, so please discuss who will use it. Can I save? What the heck is this? Oh, the color left the screen. The first trial? Will die in five minutes? Oh god, Jesus. Ah! What are we gonna do? There's no time to fret about that. Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, I can't use this? Joe! Check your clothes! Yikes. When I took the phone from my pocket, I might have dropped something. No way! Pick it up! Got it! Grabbed it! It's the key! Alright! Use the key on yourself first. Hurry and use that key! You sure? If I do, you'll... Uh... If that voice was telling the truth, I might die. But... Joe, I'm sure you can figure something out. Okay. Got it. I'll use it. Then I'll save you too, definitely! Oh no, why do I feel like we're about to die? Oh god. Damn it, that took some time. I need to save Sarah somehow. Oh, we're playing as Joe? Oh my god, look at this. Okay. This one. Okay, um. 3141. Oh my god, we have a time limit. Oh my god, a red key. I lock my restraints with this. Shoot. 3141 is written on the wall. Where are these numbers? Um. Sandpaper hangs from the ceiling. What uses this stupid thing? There's a dial to enter a four-digit number. Should I mess with this? Yes, 3141. Oh my god. Okay. Three, one, four, one. Okay. Does it just make a sound? What's the point in that? I don't know. A green lock. What should I do? Red key. The key seems to, too big to fit. So we key, is this just useless? Um, same for hangs from the ceiling. What use is this stupid thing? Wait. Shit. My best friend Sarah is tied down with green belts. Uh, is this the right time to be gazing at me? Um, an iron door? The door isn't locked, but I can't leave Sarah behind. Um, the straights are set up, but they can't be broken by force. Um, um, um. Dial it. Do I mess with this? Yes. Wait, what? Wait, is this wrong? 
I don't know. What's going on? I don't know. What are these numbers? Hanging from the ceiling? It's no good. I checked everything in this room and I still got no idea. Why does this key fit anyway? Should I look at the key again? Mm, did a bit shave off the end of the key? Oh. Oh my god. Uh, no, okay, okay. That's great, boys. Maybe I could revert it to the green key. Yes! Use it. Yes! Use it to do it. Okay, okay. Do it. Oh! Go! It's unlocked! Really? I'll remove these now! Oh my god! I think I was like a second away. Oh my god! I was a second away! <laughs> that was so stressful. I just stopped reading things and just went for it because, like, I got the gist of what they were saying. <sighs> Thank you, Joe! Can you stand? There's a door here. Let's get out of here pronto. Wait, so we're playing as Joe? Ah, uh, wait, Joe! What was that? Damn it, it's pitch black! I can't see a thing! Just stay pit, put, or go along... Uh, go along the wall. Left is dead end. Seems you can only go right. I mean it, I mean it, Sarah. Don't let us get separated. Right. We kept going straight ahead. But as far as we walked, we didn't see any light. Jesus Christ, we almost just died. It seemed to be a very, very long hallway. Or maybe we weren't advancing much at all. Joe, use the phone for light, or let's be bold and run. Um, use the phone for light. That phone you used earlier, could you try using that to light the way? Nice one, Sarah. Man, you're smart. Did you bring it? Ah, I left it back there. Guess that's that then. Hmm, what can give us some light? We were searching ourselves when suddenly... <laughs> Whoa. What? Whoa! What? Wind blowing from underneath? My feet left the ground. What are we playing as? Am I flying up? Whoa. <gasps> no! No! We're falling? The floor gave away! Gave way! Eek! How long? How high? How far are we falling? That's so freaking scary. Imagine going through that. Oh my god. I feel my senses growing distant. Yeah, honestly. I would too, probably. Oh, okay, at least we survived, apparently. Hey, get up. Who is this? Oh. Oh, more people. Oh! Whoa! This guy looks crazy. Um. <laughs> I don't even know what kind of voice I want to give this guy. Okay, uh. Hello? <laughs> you can't sit there stupefied forever, miss. I'm gonna get on a really deep voice. Huh? Where is this? Beats me. Ah. Uh. I'm alive. I'm not even hurt. What if we're like... Whoa, these people look interesting. Wait, there's a lot of people here, actually. Um, what the heck is that? What the heck? Oh, maybe it's like... Oh, it looks like someone, like, scrunched up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then... Oh, wait, that's Joe, so... There's eleven of us in total. I think that's Joe. People! Whoa, punk lady. Who the hell are you guys? Where even is this? Whoa, <laughs> these people have... Okay, how, what am I gonna call him? Oh, maybe I shouldn't... Okay, maybe I should give him the deep voice. Like, you got any idea ourselves? Calm down, lady. Is there no one who can explain? One been in overalls. Man in apron. Just what is going on? How troubling. Looks very proper. They seem too distracted to take any notice of me. What in the world is happening? Oh, I like how they're like reflected in the floor. Oh my god, this is interesting. Okay, let's do another save. Right here. Alright. 
And then, let's talk to- Oh, I couldn't go anywhere? No, we cannot. We have to talk to people. Who's this? <laughs> okay. Some slightly calmer people are talking on the left. <laughs> Alright. What's going on? Feels like we're wrapped up in something outrageous. Red-haired giant. Yes, it would appear so. Huh? Have I seen this person somewhere? Have you? Oh, whoa. Oh. The girl swatting seems terribly frightened. Did something happen? She looks very frightened. <laughs> um, okay. Let's do it on the right. Looking right, I noticed an especially restless woman. Oh god. Gah! We've been abducted by some crazy assholes! Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Be quiet, meow. Don't scream in my ear, woof. I don't know how to give these people voices. Oh. Wait a minute. Isn't this the beanie guy? From before? I don't trust him. Hey, now, fighting's no good. Ma oh, maybe I should have given him a different voice then. Hey, now, fighting's no good. Because I have too many deep voices already. I feel a tension in the air. There's even a great school age kid. Yeah, that's weird. Alright, I see Joe in the middle. In the center, there's a discussion happening centered around a single man. Alright. How what am I going to give this guy? Now hold on a second, we should confirm that what each of us knows. That's, I think that but No, that sounds like Joe, too much. <laughs> That's all well and good, but I don't even know where this is. That's all well and good, but I don't even know where this is. I'm gonna give her that voice. Whoa, <laughs> what is that guy? I had quite a terrible experience earlier, so I can't remain calm. <laughs> what the heck? They seem pretty confused. What the heck is this guy? Huh? Yeah, there's Joe. Joe? He's also wearing one of those collars. Oh, do we have a collar? <laughs> oh no. With a shiver, I touched my own neck. <laughs> there is something. Yeah, there it is. A collar? Can't get it off. Oh god. Everyone here had a collar put on them. Yeah. Okay, what are we supposed to do? The dis discussion is still going on. Finally, my head was starting to clear. There are 11 people here, including myself. I think that's more than... Um, Zero Escape. Yeah, Zero Escape usually has 9, and less than Nal and Rampa. That's interesting. All of us are wearing collars. Okay. Why isn't Joe coming over to me? Has he not noticed I'm awake? Run up and put- No, I'll call for Joe. Joe! Oh. Good, so you're okay. Oh. What? Who are you? What? What kind of joke was that? What are you saying? I'm Sarah! Did you forget your own friend's face? <laughs> Wait. Don't tell me. He's seriously saying he doesn't know me or something? What? Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Oh, wait. No, wait. He still doesn't know. Because we already said her name. Could you be the Sarah who's a terrible swimmer? What? Joe, this is not the time for jokes. <laughs> oh my god, he was kidding. What the heck, guy? Come on. My bad, my bad. <laughs> oh my god. Why does this guy have his, like, his hand out, though? Um, I want to give him a different voice, but I don't know what to give him. Hmm. <laughs> Joe and Sarah. <laughs> I don't know what voice to give him. Joe and Sarah. No, that's too deep. No, actually, that's fine. Joe and Sarah, eh? Because we're going to give that other guy more gruff. You two are friends. Eh? Huh? Why does he look like Frankenstein? Yes, we are. Thanks for that. So 
So here wasn't speaking up, see? Must have been wary or something. Why don't you even tell me his name? Oh. Alright, everybody, listen up. I bet we're all thinking the same thing. What is this place? Why was I brought here? Why is he giving me Rentaro vibes? <laughs> and about all you know is who you are. <gasps> what are you guessing at, I wonder? <laughs> I'm gonna give him that kind of voice. Man in suit. How about we give introductions? Should ease the suspicion a little, at least. Yes, let's do it. Introductions, you say? Not a whole, not a whole, not a whole lot else we can do. <laughs> Am I right, Sarah? Huh? You're asking me? Don't get friendly. No, I support it. We got. We should learn who everyone is. True. I want to clear up our situation. See, the calm ones know what to say. What the heck does that mean? Okay, once you're ready, it's introduction time. Just tell me when, Sarah. Um. Wait, what? Wait. Uh. Oh, okay. I think it means we can save. We don't need to save. We're gonna. We'll wait. Right then. Time to give introductions? Yes. Okie dokie. Alright. Oh. Okay, introductions. <laughs> Let's go. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. Interesting cast of characters. What is going on? Uh, okay. Uh, this is really weird music. <laughs> so then, I think we should all get to know each other a little more. Meow? So, Mom tells me not to give personal info to strange guys I don't know, woof. <laughs> Why should you keep doing that? Stupendous! I'll never have the child who, desires his the, who does as his parents teach him! Oh, that's a- Oh, I thought that was a girl. Okay. Yes! This is indeed- This is indeed an emergency! Hmm. <laughs> then we must prove that we adults are not suspicious characters! <laughs> what? Okay, dude. Yeah. What? Well, super suspicious, wolf. Nothing for it. Well, where should we start? <laughs> um... Oh, okay. Hey, you can keep it simple. Name an occupation. Just take turns saying them. Okay. That's the ticket. What? What is going on? This game is really weird so far. Hmm, I got it. The wary ones can be for later. Raise your hand if you don't mind blabbing. <laughs> okay. Development. Oh, okay, here we go, name. Hello, I am Kazumi Mishima. I teach at the Sunday High School. <laughs> what is going on with this guy? Eh? You're a school teacher, Wolf? What's going on to the dogs, meow? What? Boo! <laughs> what? Okay, I want to give her, like, a badass name. A ba badass voice. Name's Reiko Yabasu. Okay, name's Reiko Yabasame. I'm a sing- I'm a singer-songwriter. Oh, I think I've seen you in magazines. You're the Re you're the Reiko Yabasame? I don't know if I'm saying that right or not. Dude, is this the time? Sorry. I am Kai Sato. I'm a rather unremarkable homemaker. Okay. Um, what kind of voice should this guy get? What's with the stuff behind you? It's a frying pan, and a ladle, and a spatula. I- I didn't mean- I didn't mean like that. I'm gonna give him my voice. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> what? Guitar Burgerberg! I'm a baseball player! Second string, though! Okay. What? Uh, what kind of voice am I giving her? What? That's why you're so big? 193 centimeters and strong to boot, you hear? Okay. Seems no one else wants to talk. Okay. Well then, Sarah, how about you try asking things to people you want to hear from? M me Yep, unlike me, people aren't wary of you, right? Yeah, because you're holding out your hand like a creep. I understand. I do want to question people, but... 
Oh. I'm kind of worried about her. I'll start with who I'm most concerned about. Okay. Controls. Oh, okay, here we go. Touch a person's face to hear their statement. By touching ex extract and speaking to someone, you can extract additional statements. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool. Okay, let's save real quick. <laughs> Hold on. I, w I just want to save real quick. Okay. Um, okay, let's extract from everyone who's talked so far first. Let's do this guy. Oh, okay, so they don't show their face. I am Kazumi Mishima! I teach in the Sunday School! <laughs> Incidentally, I teach Japanese and art! <laughs> huh? Uh, huh? A school teacher? <laughs> Can't picture it. Hey, it looks like an evil scientist. Indeed, I hear that often! Okay, I'm gonna be right back. I need to blow my nose, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, this is becoming a problem. Alright, I'm back, I blew my nose. Okay, so... What's he saying here? I've got no right to say it, but you're suspicious from every angle. <laughs> no, honestly. You truly don't have any right to say that! Apologize to the professor, please! Wait, so... She knows him? Moda, what's this little miss? Pardon! You see, she's a former student of mine! Please forgive her! He's a really good teacher! Please don't judge a book by its cover! I suppose my appearance is shady after all. How shocking! Well, don't have much else to judge on. Don't know much about you either, little miss. Oh, okay. I'll introduce myself! There's nothing guilty about us! I'm gonna do like a ta fast talking voice for her. Well, excuse me. <laughs> it's time to cool down, yes! Should I ask Professor Mishima something? Okay, yeah. Hmm, I don't recall hurting anyone's eye, huh? I see. Of course, surely there have been times I've been disliked by students, but... Yeah, I can see how that would happen. <laughs> no, no student would cause such an incident, so I'd like to believe. For after all, as you can see, I even have students who come to visit me after graduation. <laughs> I believe we made it through the first trial thanks to our combined knowledge as well. Oh. Oh, so he was with um, the pink-haired lady in the overalls. The first trial? Okay. Um. Okay. I'm a former student of Professor Mishima. It's currently at an art college. <laughs> My name is now Echo Koro. It's thanks to Professor Mishima that I attend an art college now. <laughs> the professor's a good person. Please believe me, Sarah. <laughs> I'm not especially. I'm not especially doubting it. <laughs> yep, you're Mr. Policeman he here who suspected him. Just oh, yep, just Mr. Policeman here who suspected him. Oh, you're a policeman? Then please, repent! Sure, Professor Mishima is not suspicious. So you understand, in that case my work here is done. I should ask now something too. About the first trial or memory of being brought- No, I want to ask this. The first trial? It was terrifying! Wait, is it getting darker on the screen? No, it's not. It was a game where we, we were tried to tied to beds- Jesus Christ, I can't speak. And we had to escape with just one key. That's the same thing we did. I... Professor Mishima instructed me to use the sandpaper on the key. Then I unlocked his restraints. Right. Honestly, it's thanks to him I was able to stay calm. Trust. Was that a game that evaluated trust? Why would the culprit make us do that? I don't know. Were they watching? Watching a despicable game? The toys of people's lives? Sarah, are you okay? You look angry. Oh, I'm fine. I don't like that policeman, but I kind of like you, Sarah. Huh? Please don't take care of your friend. Uh. <sighs> Why is my nose so stuffed right now? Oh my god. Okay, so... We still need to talk to those three. Um, let's do some more extracting. Wait, who is this girl? Oh, she's the t one that's terrified. Okay, let's do this one guy. I'm Kitaro Burgerberg, baseball player! Okay. Um, this guy? Right. 
I am Ka Kai Sato, a rather unremarkable homemaker. My, hmm, my best meal is Eggs Benedict. Oh, Eggs Benedict would sit so well right now. I want that so bad. Please make me some. Well, I guess we don't have the materials here. A chef, huh? A chef, eh? No, not a chef, but a homemaker. Akin to a house husband. Same difference if you both make tasty food. I suppose so. I feel like I've met this person somewhere. Really? Do you know me? Uh... Oh, it's fine. If you don't remember, it must just be me. Miss Sarah? What? Huh? Do you know me? I simply heard your name earlier. Oh. <laughs> so it's our first time meeting after all. I felt like I'd met him somewhere, but talking to him, it doesn't feel that way at all. Is it just my imagination? Perhaps I should discard my cookware. Hmm, but it could be useful for something. Yeah, like if someone tried to attack you or something. At the least, I bet I could make eggs benedict. <laughs> yeah, I'd ra I remember if I'd met such a weirdo. Probably. Um, okay. Did her, did them. So we did all three of those in this guy. Let's extract from her. Reiko Yabasame. I'm a song. I'm a singer songwriter. Okay. How about this girl? Fighting. Oh yeah, we haven't talked to her yet. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh my god! Now my ears hurting. What the heck is going on with me? She's not in a condition to talk. <laughs> Gently calm her down. Are you okay? Oh. Don't be afraid, I won't do anything. I gently placed my hand on her trembling back. Ah! Uh? Oh? Oh! She's really sweet looking. Thank you very much. I'm gonna do like a very meek voice for her. It seems she calmed down a little. I'll try talking to her again. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Still in no condition to talk. Oh, what? Okay, let's do... Oh, really? I thought she was able to talk now. Um, okay. <laughs> um, who else we have left? We only have him. Huh? Did I not introduce myself? I don't think so. Yeah, here we go. My name's Keiji Shinogai. Working as a policeman. Huh? Police? Wait. Oh yeah, we're missing Joe, too. You got it? You got it! So don't trouble your friendly policeman. Well, not that I'm really that sort of cop. <laughs> I feel like he's not a policeman. I feel like he's lying. Then you should have mentioned that sooner. I got abducted in the middle of an investigation. It was tough to find a chance to spill it. Oh, he's kind of attractive. Jesus, guys. <laughs> Damn, dude. This guy, is, this guy is kind of attractive. Shouldn't have been wary. Damn it. Oh, okay. Wonder if we got caught by that criminal group. Criminal group? What's that? A group of petty thieves. I doubt they're related to this, honestly. Is your coworker not here? Sure isn't. So it's not like everyone came in pairs. Oh. Okay. Okay, now we have him. Me and Sarah are high school classmates. <laughs> Sarah's being harassed by a stalker, so I went home with her that day. Then there was an incident, so I called the police, but... I heard Sarah screaming, so I ran upstairs. And there stood that damn stalker! Huh? That's the first I've heard of that! <laughs> Didn't have a chance to mention it. So, I worked up all my courage to punch the guy. Of course, I'm awful at fighting, so since I don't remember winning, I'm guessing I lost. Why do I not trust him? Why do I not trust this guy? <laughs> I feel like... I don't know. Okay, people who I don't trust initially, this... Uh, I don't trust Joe. I feel like I should, but I just don't. I don't trust KG. I don't trust this guy in the beanie. Especially because of that opening entrance. I feel like this guy isn't going to be trustworthy. 
I don't know what to think of this guy. <laughs> this kid just seems weird. Um, this guy, I don't really trust either. Her, I don't really, I don't really think anything of her. This girl seems like she's just gonna be like, like annoyed. <laughs> okay, that's just my initial opinions. This girl just seems afraid of everything. All right, that's why. I know that Stalker is the culprit in this case. Probably. Interesting. Uh, interesting. Go on. Sorry, but that's all I got, since I faded. Then again, this isn't a stunt just one jerk Stalker could pull by himself. It's an organized crime, right, Mr. Kirop? Could be. Hmm. What if there's one in our midst? Oh. <gasps> like one of the culprits hiding among us? Yeah, a collaborator with the culprit, playing the victim to blend in. I feel like it would be this guy, <laughs> the, the beady guy. I don't know if the mouse is showing on the screen or not. <laughs> eh? Oh, God. <laughs> Hearing Joe say that, I understood. Why do I feel like it's him? <laughs> or the beady guy? Why have you been so wary and acting so strange? <laughs> What is it? You want to laugh? You can't say there isn't. You sure are funny. <laughs> what? I hate this guy. Yeah, they don't seem like to get along. A collaborator with the culprit. Maybe there could be something like that. Or maybe one of these people are the culprit. Yeah. Alright. Can we get anything else? Right. Okay. Um, did we distract from her? Right, currently at an art college. The first trial, it was terrifying. Only one key, but we sanded it down and managed to escape. Okay. Right. Okay. Right. Yeah, I'm a ball player, but if you work out too much and hurt your chair and hurt yourself, you'll you'll never hit the bag the big leagues. Ugh, it hurts my voice. Even among this bunch, this guy stands out. What country are you from? What dialect is that? Um, let's just ask country. I don't got a clue where I was born, neither. I had parents, but off they went for. I could even remember him. Oh, okay. Still, my nationality's Japanese. Don't know about the dialect, but it's a mix. Ain't nothing can be fixed if you don't- if you talk it out. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Okay, this guy's finally talking. What kind of voice do you want to give him? Incidentally, I believe baseball has positions. Yeah, I'm just gonna give him my voice. Incidentally, I believe baseball has positions. I'm a pitcher, confident in my batting too. And I was lucky enough to go to Central League. I don't really follow, but does that mean you're good at both throwing the ball and hitting it with the bat? <laughs> well, yeah, that's right. I don't know baseball either, but he seems pretty proud of his strength. I was all happy after a long and cubbing comeback game, so I went drinking. Then I don't remember a thing. Then when I wake up, I got a collar on, this, on in this place, like I'm a dog or something. Such a bummer. Can't believe I can't get this thing off. Even his strength can't remove it. Interesting. Oh, we still have the beanie guy. Um, I, I don't know what to do. I can't hit the ones that aren't lit up yet. These two need to, like, speak. They're kind of weird. <laughs> um. Hmm. Huh? No, you did. Right. Right. If I do something myself. Okay. Right. Thanks to the two of us working together, we were able to overcome the first trial. Good student, I have indeed. Okay. I'm quite concerned. It's quite concerning to have been brought here with the laundry still out trying. No, I don't remember if I met such a weirdo. How about this girl? Songwriter. Just like the gaudy guy said, my fans made enough of a name to get into magazines. Don't call me the gaudy guy. We finally made it to the starting line. The whole future stretched ahead of us. Um, is that makeup for performances? Like hell, the fans... The fans would sweep if I went on stage looking this plain. Oh my god, hold on. 
I'm gonna go get some water. I'm gonna get a cup of water because my voice is like having problems. Okay, I'm back. I drank some water and I also talked to my mom a little bit. Um, just because we wanted to have a little conversation before she went to bed because I'm recording this kind of late. But yeah, I'm back. So, um, okay. So we were talking to her. She was talking about her makeup. Um, <laughs> she was like, oh yeah, the, the, um, overalls girl was like, well, it just happened. I, I remember what we were talking about. Okay. Like hell, the fans would weep if I went on stage looking this plain. That's plain? I finished the new track, so I had plans to meet with my bandmates, and this sh and then this shit happens. Oh. A session, I, I guess. Was your instrument taken? Why well, can't- You can't contact them? So that's that. Naturally, all my stuff's gone. My precious bongos, my phone, my wig, it's all gone! Bongos. Goddamn kidnappers! If you throw my- If you throw out my stuff, I'm gonna beat your ass so hard! It's not the time to- It's- It's not the time to worry about belongings! Some of that stuff's as important as my life! I'm sorry! All her stuff was taken, huh? Yeah, apparently. Oh! Yes, can you please finally introduce yourself? Ah, uh, I should introduce myself too soon. Wait. Ah, uh, I should introduce myself too soon, huh? Yes, please do. Fine, I can read the room, woof. It's, you know, the mature response, meow. I don't- I don't enjoy her. <laughs> I just don't enjoy the weirdness of her, like, meowing, barking. Or him. It's him. I keep forgetting it's a him. I'm sorry. Um, let's do the beating guy first, since he talked first. Well then, should I introduce myself too? My name's So Hiyori. Er, well, just a job hopper. <laughs> it's a living hand to mouth meow? Hey, don't put it like that. It's not a ton, but I've got savings. Why wouldn't you introduce yourself at first? Naturally, I was wary like Joe was. Plus, saying I'm a job hopper is a little embarrassing. <laughs> that is definitely the fucking... That is the guy! He's, he's the one behind this. Come on now. Just make up some lie, meow. You're honest to a fault, wolf. Hey now, I don't I don't know about that. You can't trust people like that, right? He's always smiling. He seems kind or maybe more timid. <laughs> Come on now, don't look don't look me so pitifully. Miss Sarah, you seem steadfast and strong. I'm jealous. Actually I wanted to ask something. Um ideas about this incident. Let's do it. Gosh, feels like you're asking me in such a first things first way. Ideas, huh? I've got none. I like his style though, it's pretty cool. I apologize for arguments right away, so not that. Ha haven't even left enough impression on anyone to be hated by someone. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I apol oh, I apologize for arguments right away, so not that. I haven't even left an enough impression on anyone to be hated by someone. Some days I think that I don't show enough gratitude to my parents, but... They just spoil me so much. Man, I gotta become independent already. Uh, sorry. I can't remember anything much. Well, neither can we. Right. Why is he smiling like that? Don't sweat it! Once you get home, go find a job, meow. Ha! Ugh, job hunting. Steady work. Like he looks like he's been crushed under not only the immediate fear, but an uncertain future. Wow. <laughs> That's kind of funny. His name is So. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna really remember these. Okay, I remember this guy's last name is Burger. It's gonna be hard to remember these names. Well then, should I introduce myself too? Oh, you already did. Okay, um... Alright, last one. Strange child. I can read the room too, meow. Okay. Yes. My name is Jin Ibushi, wolf. I'm a sixth grader, meow. Wait, so this is a guy? I can't tell. 
Um, I'm giving him like a more of a girlish voice, I think. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Great introduction, kiddo. Don't call me a kid. I just I just introduced myself because you guys don't seem like anything special, Wolf. Do you remember anything about why you were brought to this place? Wolf, nope. My, my mo mom was late coming home, so I stayed up to wait, and I heard the intro alarm, so I thought she was back and opened the door, meow. I've never grown up with standing there, meow. Don't remember anything else, Wolf. Uh-oh. I see. Jin. Don't give me those looks, Wolf. I'm a strong boy, meow. He's acting tough, but he must be scared. Let's work together to go home. Yeah. What? Work together? Woof woof. Right, not all grown-ups are bad, Jin. Can I believe that, Meow? Of course! I'll only trust you, Big Sis Sarah. Woof. Uh, big Sis? What the heck? Huh? It's not Big Bro, is it, Woof? <laughs> Maybe I got it all wrong, Meow. That's not the problem. If I had a little brother, I wonder if he'd talk to me like that. <laughs> These people are weird. Okay, what next? Wait, what am I supposed to do now? Um... Wait, how long is the recording been going? Oh my god, we've been recording for an hour already? Holy crap. Well, I think that's where we're gonna end it then, because... <laughs> um, a lot, I guess a lot happened so far, yeah, that makes sense then. Okay, and um... This has been your turn to die! It's really starting to be cool already. I like the pixelated version, I like all the character portraits, it's really cool. Um, I like the style too. Um, I guess we'll continue in the next one. I hope you guys will enjoy this series. It looks really fun and really cool. It's a lot like Danganronpa and Zero Escape, I think. Um, yeah, definitely like, like those two very much. Um... But yeah, I think I will see you guys soon. Uh, this will probably be going up next week from where I'm, when I'm recording this. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and uh, consider subscribing to see more content like this. And leave a comment in the subscri- not in the subscription, in the comments section, because that's where the comments go. And tell me how you liked the video and give me any critiques or anything and I'll try to reply to you. And um... Anything else, read the description. It always has something a little tailored to every little video that I put out. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!